Your destination is on the right. Today, we are taking a look at what seems to be a lot of new Toyota Tacomas at another new car dealership, Toyota dealership, in Central Ohio. So, I can't wait. It's like being a kid in a candy store, right? Let's jump out, and I think we even have a Blue Crush Tacoma up there. Let's go take a look. I believe that's a Tacoma. Um, we have several. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine over there. And the blue crush up here would make ten that I can see anyway on this lot here in Columbus. Blue crush. First time I'll have actually seen one of these in person. Let's see. It is a TRD Sport. That is a pretty striking color. Check that out. Looks even better in person. Might put it up there with uh, eh, a little below the voodoo blue. But nonetheless, it's got a little bit of a purple hue to it. So, let's check it out. This is not an iForce Max. Let's take a look on the inside. Looks like it has the big screen in there. And the cloth seats with the kind of darker trim if you will let's go around to the other side see what they're asking for this puppy notice it's parked up here as opposed to out there I don't know this is 51 945 it is a 4x4 four four. of course it's a double cab with the side steps on it the TRD wheels all that good stuff and then it does have the spray in liner with the rear sliding window. One other thing I'm curious, does it have the push button on the side for the tailgate? It does not. All right, let's uh, run down the line. This is kind of like the old days when you'd go to the car dealer and they had a row of vehicles you could actually look at, right? Not sure if that's good for the <laughs> Tacoma but at least they have some in stock. This is a sport short bed, does have the tonneau cover on it. Obviously it is in black. Has the big screen on the inside. Price wise, 54, 468. This one, which I don't like, you can see it has that uh, trim that is kind of a lighter silverish color, not, not digging that. Um, does have cloth black seats on the inside. Again, it has the tonneau cover. And let's check real quick. Does not have the button over here. Next to it, we have this new oxide color. Why they went with chrome for the tailpipe, I don't know. Chrome wheels, ew. This is obviously, a, what, an SR? This is a limited. Chrome wheels, yuck. First limited I've seen in person, chrome on the door handles. Come on, Toyota. Let's take a look inside. It has the white or gray, I don't know what you'd call it, off-white um, leather-ish seats. The bigger screen, of course, the limited is one of the upper trim levels. Cannot wait to see uh, what the sticker is on this. It does have electric side steps. This thing's going to cost a fortune, I can imagine already. Also has the protection on the front. And look at the grill. Oh my God. Chrome. This thing is chrome laden. What are they asking for? Oh, chrome mirror caps. 55744. Uh, not quite as bad as I thought it was going to be. Uh, let's check the rear. They put any other chrome back here? Uh, yeah, we got a little chrome on the Toyota handle to open the tailgate. Next to it, we've got a TRD Sport. This is a short bed, does have the rear slider, as does the Limited over there. Let's take a quick peek inside. Does have that white or lighter colored trim, big screen, and cloth black seats. Let's check out the sticker on this. This next one, or two, actually have uh, the Toyota roof racks on them. First I've seen those in person. 
50,914 on this truck. It is a 4x4. Next to it, we've got an SR5. Again, does have the Toyota uh, roof rack on it. Uh, a more basic truck, obviously. This does have the light-colored interior. You can see there. It does have the pewter uh, trim work, though. Now, let's check and see. The roof rack, $1,100. Let's call it $1,200, right? So this thing is going to cost you $1,200. bucks. does say Toyota on it. Eh, that's a bit much, in my opinion. I don't know. Price-wise, $48,218 for an SR5. And this is a 4x4. Next to it is another SR5. Yeah, I'm just not really digging that. I don't know. It doesn't look horrible, but ah, $1,200. This one looks like the same truck. Uh, has the light interior there. You can see uh, the smaller screen. Uh, let's go around and check the sticker on this one. This one's going for $48,218. So a little bit less. Next to it, we've got, what is this? This is not marked. Look, they've debadged this truck. Let's see what it is. Probably an SR, that's my guess. Uh, it is an SR. An SR. First one I think I might have seen in person on an SR. Um, pretty uh, bland on the inside. Nothing special in there. Small screen, black cloth seats. Even has a darker trim though. I do like that right above the uh, or glove box there. I like that trim. The lowest level, 40,553. Does have steps, no spray in bed liner. Uh, is this a long bed? Let's see. Uh, it does not say it's a long bed. I guess it is not. Just looked a little long there to me. Next we have a TRD off road. Small screen on the inside of here. Got the uh, two-tone cloth seats. Let's run around real quick and see what the pricing is. I can tell it already has the uh, blacked out package on it, so that's gonna cost you a little bit more. Um, doesn't really specify it. Uh, body side molding. Nope, don't see it, but this truck is 45,215, and it is a four by four. Moving on down, we've got two left. This is a TRD Sport. Does have the two-tone interior with the bigger screen. That's the one thing I guess I kind of wish I had was the bigger screen in my truck. Let's run around the other side, see what pricing is. We know it's not going to be low, right? This one is 50365 uh, and the biggest option they have on here is the TRD Sport Upgrade Package, $4,640. Wow. Lastly, looks like we have another SR. I know that because it's not marked, has the Predator side steps on it. Um, not horrible wheels for the SR either. I don't dig the kind of silver look, but they're not horrible. Moving around to the side... Price-wise, this one is 37 so we're below the $40,000 mark, and that's because there's just not much on this truck. Uh, it is a 4x2, by the way, so that's probably why we're below the $40,000 mark. You can see right here, 4x2, double cab, Tacoma SR. Does have a tonneau cover on the back, though. That thing uh, would cost you $1,295, or we'll call it $1,300. Anyway, those are the uh, Tacomas they have here at this dealership. Uh, quite a few more, obviously, than we've seen in the past. We do seem to see the numbers increasing on the Tacomas. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this group. Any of these interest you or nah, not so much? I'd be curious to know. By the way, I would love to run into a pro or a trail hunter at some point. Sooner or later, there's going to be one available out in the wild. We shall see. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there. Bye. Look at the black trim over here. Do you guys like that? Black trim on a silver or gray truck? I don't know.